YouTube. Today we're going to look at my Hinderer collection. Got it out of the case, we're going to better look at it, and I'm shooting this on my phone, so hopefully it's a little better than the audio crap that I did before. Um, got my Hinderer collection, my official Hinderers. None of these are uh, clones or um, aftermarket guys. They're all straight from the ranch, so let's take a look at them. And I have this right on my couch. I figured it might be better lighting to take a look at. Um, so let's do this. Hopefully my fat finger doesn't get on the way. So I did these in my case a little differently. I put all the hinderers on this one shelf. I just pulled that shelf out, obviously, but I did them all chronologically in the way that I actually received them. So let's start. This is the first one that I received ever. I got this on a Facebook uh, flash sale, and it's been my most carried, obviously. I carried this one for six months straight. And it is the three inch Warncliffe stone wash. And I put a uh, bronze clip and filler and some bronze standoffs on it, if you can take see that. Just give it some, uh, you know, some color. This one is perfectly centered, used a lot and carried a lot, but you know, honestly, it still looks brand new. I just love this Warncliffe. The, my favorite thing about the Warncliffe is this view right here. You have that switch right here, that top part, that flat nose, that sharp, aggressive edge. Just looks awesome. And this one is one of my favorite flippers too because it's an older style D10, so you can easily thumb it open. There's no like hard break of the D10. You can middle finger flip it and you can push button it and actually pull it back opens no problems and I put my paramilitary here so you can get an idea of the size what I really love about this is actually the blade is pretty big considering but so much more smaller handle than the paramilitary so yeah that was the first one and still my favorite The next one I got, also on the Facebook, um, this one's really cool. This is one I've wanted ever since I got it in Hinderers. This is a three inch Sponto. There we go. Love the Sponto grind. Think it's one of the coolest grinds and definitely wanted to get this one because it's one of uh, Hinderers original blade grinds, designs anyway. This one I just left plain. I used, I originally had a uh, orange scale, but I put a translucent green on it, and I think that looks awesome. But as you can see, just plain Jane. Nothing special, but I love this knife. This one has a much harder detent, so I don't know if you can, even, you can probably even hear it. It just flies out, break, the detent breaks, and it just flies out. This one you can't really slowly thumb open like the last one. It's, it's like as soon as you break that detent, it just flies open. Yeah, I can't even slowly open it as opposed to this one, which is the older style detent, which look at that, you just slowly can thumb it. I actually like this because you can do this. That one, I could try to shake that one out all day. Ain't gonna happen. Again, pretty plain S35EN, stone washed. Really fits really good in the hand. Good user, really strong knife. Love it. All right, my, well, I guess the third one that I got, not necessarily, I've sold some other ones, but I guess in my current collection, this is the third hinderer that I got. This one, I've made this one a bit more gentlemanly. I put a carbon fire smooth scale with bronze, everything possible. Clip, nuts, standoff, screws, and pivot. This is the spear point. And this one's actually in CPM S20 CV. So you don't, I don't really see these anymore, unfortunately, but really good deal on paper. Uh, really love the way this feels. This thing is, is my current most carried knife. It used to be that one, but now it's this one. It's just like no nonsense, straightforward. And I just love kind of like that gentleman look of like the carbon fiber. Oop. To give you an idea of size, here is that guy. Very similar, 
but definitely this one's a lot more beefier. Much, much better flipper, much thicker stock. 